at CC University, there was a teacher who liked drinking coffee a lot. Because of her hobby, she owned a lot of coffee pots. One day, an unusual thing happened. Welcome, students. Let's have some nice hot coffee together. Oh, thank you. Yes, please. The coffee will be great on such a cold day. Wait, where is Anna? I also wanted to talk to her. Was she in her classes today? I haven't seen her. Oh, she was busy moving to a new apartment today. I heard that she moved, moved out of her family's home and into an apartment of her own. Well, that's understandable. But I do hope she comes. I can give her the homework from today. I'll tell her if I see her. Yeah, me too. No matter. Recently, I got a new coffee pot from an antique shop in Kyoto. <laughs> this coffee pot is my favorite, but I haven't used it yet. So why don't we try it? I'm happy to do that, teacher. I'll switch on this coffee maker. I'm sure it'll be ready soon. I can't wait to taste it. The student busily seated on the coffee maker. The water soon began to sizzle. Then suddenly, a sound came from the coffee pot. Oh! Oh! It's too hot! <laughs> wow, what is the noise? Did the coffee pot just say something? Certainly no. I'm burning! It's too hot! Please switch it off! Please! Who are you? I'm the coffee pot. <laughs> it's too hot! Switch it off! Please! Oh my goodness! <laughs> the coffee pot is alive! Is this a dream? What's happening? It's a nightmare. Talking coffee pot. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> What should we do? We can't leave this everything here, not in the university. We can't keep it here. I don't know, but we are not staying. The thing is closed. Living alone. Do you need a coffee pot? Oh, thank you. I was planning to buy a new coffee pot too. Thank you so much. Great. It's yours. Fine. <laughs> While the secret of the coffee pot still remained a secret to Anna, she happily took it back to her apartment and proudly put her new coffee pot in her little kitchen. What's that puppy song? Did I leave my TV on? Who's there? Hello? Suddenly, the kitchen tent and four kids, which were probably short hair, emerged from the coffee pot. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. what are you doing here? It must be dreaming. Oh, I'm sorry for surprising you. I'm a Tanuki who lives the island who lived uh, around Mount and Kyoto. I was bullied by my friends, but I escaped from them and ran away from the mountain. I will be hiding in this forest ever since. Please allow me to stay here for a while. I was very surprised. I understand your story, but I still can't believe it. It must be black magic. I promise I couldn't harm anyone, not even fly. I'm just a simple tanuki who needs a home. Well, Mrs. Nuki, my name is Anna. I recently moved into this apartment by myself 
but I can barely afford to pay the rent as it is, so I can't keep you here. Oh, breathe! I wouldn't be much trouble. I don't eat a lot. I'm very clean for an animal. Oh, I just couldn't. I don't even know if I'm allowed to keep pets in this apartment. <laughs> pet? I'm not a pet animal. Yes, but I'm not a pet. There must be some way to help you make money. Hmm. Hey, that was the sounds that I heard from my bedroom. It's very good. Where did you learn how to do that? What? Well, that is how tankies communicate. All tankies can do it. Well, it's very good. And it sounds like human beatboxing. Some performers have become because of their beatboxing. Really? So people would enjoy hearing me make these sounds and, and uh, they would also pay to hear them. I hear. I can perform uh, and I can, treat, I can perform streets of Kyoto and many people will come to see me. Yeah. You know, it might just work. Beatbox is a new kid. Everyone love it. That's a great idea. I think we could actually make this work. The next day, Anna posted an advertisement on a building board at school. It read the world famous beatboxing penalty. Soon after, a friend, friend started to form. It seemed everyone was keen to see the beatboxing competition. Competition. I think we will win. Really? I think that's great. I'm happy to help you. The Tanuki started in performance on the streets of Kyoto to prepare for the competition. But one day, the Tanuki fell ill and then then. No, please tell my friend. Please don't give up. 
I applied for you to enter the beatboxing competition. You can't say no. My condition is very bad. I have fun spending time with you and beatboxing, but my magic is fading now. I'm sorry. Thank you, friend, for your friendship. And just like that, the energy physically and changed back into the cold coffee pot. No, please don't go. I should have taken better care of your health. Thank you for your friendship. Thank you. Anna cried very much, but the coffee pot did not turn back into the canopy. A few days later, Anna cleaned the coffee pot and brought it back to the teacher's office. She explained what had happened to her in the big boxing coffee pot. This coffee pot belonged to you, so I want you to take care of it. I couldn't to keep I couldn't bear to keep you knowing how much I miss my friend. Please keep your key safe. He no longer has the ability to transform back into the Kanuki form, so he won't cause you any trouble. Oh, it sounds like the both of you had a wonderful adventure. I understand. I'll keep it safe. It is such a lovely pot. I'm glad to have it back. The big boxing coffee pot never turned back into the Kanuki again. Anna soon graduated from university and missed her friend every day. From time to time, she still views her cherished memory on the Instagram, world's famous beatboxing Kanuki. The end.